fellow practice score users. Now that we have learned how to set up matches, score matches, and be an administrator in practice score, today we're going to learn how to upload the scores to practice score and be able to get them on IDPA's website with the range log export. The first thing I like to do after a match is enter scores to be sure that everything is green, indicating that all stages have been scored for all shooters. The next step we would do is view results. This is what we do at the end of a match and show the um, results to the shooters that participated at that point. But today we want to post these to practice score. Uh, be sure that you are connected either to your phone's hotspot or when you get home to your local wireless internet at your residence to be able to post from the tabs to practice score. At that point you simply click post to practice score. This information will be filled in and you hit continue and you are done. That's all there is to that. We will now take a look at practice score to find those results. The easiest way is going to practice score Dot com in which we will see the match results here at the top. We want to click that. To find the results for our club, Cross Timbers Action Shooting Association, we have made sure that we have included CTASA at the beginning of every match, so we simply type CTASA. Immediately, the match names are updated for our matches. We click on the match date for the match that we are looking for, and here are our results. To be viewed and sorted by rank, etc. To post it to the forum, you would simply go up to the address bar and copy this link. You would go to the forum, match scores, post a new thread, give it some indication of the title so that we know what we're looking at. Any erratica that you want to put here as far as thanking the uh, breakdown setup crew, that type of information congratulating the winners would go there. Then you would click on this symbol, this icon here, which is the link icon and paste what we copied from the other image. It will give you a results uh, type of thing, something similar to this. At that point, you would submit the thread. I clicked preview just to show that this is the way it will show on the forum. Now anybody that comes to the forum to see the match results knows where to find them. So now that we've got the results up on practice score, how do we get them on the IEPA website so that people have their results attached to their membership. We use the range log export which is IDPA's software. We select to share in my case. You could also save to an SD card, pull the SD card out, read it on your computer, do that type of thing. I find it easiest to share using Gmail and I simply send this CSV file to myself. Once you have emailed that CSV file to yourself and you have it in your inbox, you would want to download it to your computer. Then you want to upload that to the IDPA website. To do that, you would log in to your to the IDPA website. You would have to have had the administrator, in our case, our board of directors, allow you to be able to see the settings and administrate the club. When you do that, you can find what do you want to do right above your profile. You want to add an upcoming match. Go and fill in the information here for the match that you want to post scores on. So is this a classifier match? No. It is a local match for our club matches. What is the name of your event? 
here we would insert the name of the match as we want it to appear. One of the handy things if you are a match director you can input your match dates starting on every Thursday and have it repeat with your times and then simply click repeat which will give you the options to repeat this weekly monthly or annually until a given time IDPA doesn't like us to go much over a year so we're going to enter this to repeat until the year 2016 once that is done we would click done I clicked cancel because this match has already been set up that is how you would set up a repeating match so you don't have to go in and do that every month or every week now that you have your match set up you can go back to your what do you want to do box and scores for a recent match after we click go we have this box here that shows us the different matches that have been set up for an annual basis not all of the cross timbers matches are set up here you may need to set up your own match uh, in this case we're going to enter the scores for March 28th match and it is asking us to select a file to import that will be the CSV file that we sent from the range log export we select the CSV file that we need and then select import scores on occasion there will be a problem with a shooter either an incorrect IDPA number uh, unrecognized division something of that nature as we see here we have imported 22 shooters with one having a problem the problem is indicated by the red X next to the shooters name when we click that we see that the IDPA number is invalid we do have the shooters name we simply copy it we can easily go to the IDPA website click on the member tab by pasting his name and searching we see that we have Fred Hawkins and there is his correct number it was entered in the device as 913133 the correct number is 91233 to correct that we will have to open the CSV file locate that shooter and make the correction to his IDPA number Once we have corrected that information, then what we would select to clear the imported data. Now we will re upload the data with the correct info in our CSV file. Upon doing that, we now see that we have success. All 23 shooters are entered correctly. There are no red X's next to any shooter's names. With that complete, we can send an email to the shooters. We can also mark the scores as final. This will allow the scores to show up in the IDPA's profile. Give match bump. Any of the other information we should not touch unless this is a sanctioned match and you are familiar with those options. Our match has now successfully been exported via the range log export to the IDPA website. Emails have been sent to the shooters and the match has been marked final. 
I hope this helps some of my fellow MDs with um, doing electronic scoring, getting them up on the internet with practice score and with range log exporter for the IDPA site, letting our members know the results of our matches. I want to say thank you for being a match director and for your volunteer time. It's really appreciated. Have a good one. Shoot straight.